Hello there guys and gals, the Welsh Hunter here back with yet another 100% achievement guide and this time we are getting it all in Catish. Now this was developed by... Published by Weakfish Studio Publishing and it's available for £4.19 slash $4.99. So we play as Catish and if you want to know what that is, well it's not quite a cat, it's not quite a fish. So to, to answer your question, I don't know. Uh, but it is actually a cat and it's an easy platformer as we avoid spikes and bugs and all types of things to get to the end. So as for achievements, we just have to complete and beat the first 10 levels, which should literally only take you anywhere between 2-5 to five minutes. Yes, it is another simple Dr. Pimple popping game. Not much else to say, so I'll see you in 5 minutes with another glorious 1k. Let's do it! So, controls are obviously simple as always, left and right on the left stick, press the A button to jump, and that's about it. So, again, to beat the levels, we just have to go through the door, so head through. The A button, of course, to jump, so jump over to the other side. It doesn't really jump far, so keep that in consideration and in your mind. These are the spikes that we need to avoid. As you can see, you will die straight off, so let's not do that. So again, you can't jump uh, up too high, to be honest. You'll have to go right, left, right... Jump over, jump to the end again. Now, there are boxes as well which you can press. Now, bear in mind you have to press the B button once to hold on and the B button again to let go. So just keep that one in mind, but push the box over to the spikes, jump up, and that finishes that one. With this one, jump over to the left-hand side and jump over again. Press the B button and you can pull it back. Don't go onto the spikes, of course. Push it um, onto the spike, then jump over. Pull it again. Remember, you have to press the B button to hold on and to let go, remember? So just push it all the way off, jump down, and now give yourself a bit of a running jump, and that will complete that one. So this one is a bit, uh, can be a bit tricky just because of the last spike right here. So what I do is go, wait until it goes over to the left, and then big, do a big jump over to it. It seems easy, but that, that did take me a couple of tries. With this one, you have to watch out for the bug. So wait until the spiky ball comes to you, jump in the middle, jump over the bug. Sorry that that one was a bit quick, and get that one done. With this level, you can't jump over the balls, so we'll just wait for them to pass by. The blue balls of life, wait for them to just jump by. And then as soon as the balls are flying over your head, it's, it's a big ball party. Uh, complete the level. Right, this one may take a few tries. What you need to do is push the box over to the left, but of course the bug is quite quick. So push it over, jump up, push it over to the spike, jump up. And then you should be good to go. And on to the next level, and this is the last level that we have to do, so uh, just drop down, not not, not death-wise, drop down to the next platform. As soon as the bug goes over the left, jump over him and jump up, and that will complete that level, and that will actually complete the game. So, there we go, nice and easy. Um, yeah, like I said, you can get this anywhere between two and five minutes, depending on how many times you die. I did die a few times, but it still only took me four minutes. Uh, 10 out of 10, there may be title updates in the future, you know everyone loves a good title update, but there we go, so thank you so, so much for watching guys and gals, uh, if, if of course if you did, the guy did help, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share with a friend as well, big shout out to everyone who continues to support the channel on Patreon, and I'll see you in the next one, big love!